I say yes to every scary thing that comes my way. Be bold is like my hashtag. You can see it in my hair. <laughs> and when I got my big girl job, I decided to get a bike that had a push button start and can take highway speeds. It's a big step up. I think people taking risks to try things that have never been done before are the people that I would say are my heroes. I'm in a motorcycle club called Rainier Ravens. It's probably 65 or 70 women now who all ride. The thing I love about riding with all these women is I'm meeting people I wouldn't otherwise meet who are in kind of different walks of life and have come from different backgrounds that I wouldn't cross paths with others. Really don't want to waste this life being boring. I started coming to Planned Parenthood right out of college and I have stayed with Planned Parenthood for a lot of my wellness needs ever since. I come here for cancer screening. Um, I'm now talking about what menopause is going to be like. At one point I went to a different provider for my annual exam and I got a little bit of a lecture about my choice to not have children. And that nurse actually made me feel pretty bad about not having kids and told me that my eggs were getting old and that I better hurry up. So I came back to Planned Parenthood with a new appreciation and that was really important to have a place that I could go to that I felt that I could trust and I can go anywhere from healthcare. But I choose Planned Parenthood and I continue to come back here because of the level of individualized care that I get. Going to Planned Parenthood as a patient just made sense to me. It's a way to vote with my wallet. I think everyone who supports Planned Parenthood sort of in their heart should think about seeking healthcare there.